Hello, welcome again to Fun with Maths. Here's another exponential problem. 3 to the power of x minus 2 to the power of x is equal to 65. Solve for x. Here's the solution. Let's write down. 3 to the power of x minus 2 to the power of x equals 65. Now for this, we are going to insert a power which is equivalent to 1. And that is 3 to the power of x whole to the power of 2 over 2 minus 2 to the power of x whole to the power of 2 over 2 equals 65. Now if you observe, our power is 2 over 2, and that is simply equivalent to 1. So for this, we have the rule a to the power of m whole to the power of n is also equal to a to the power of m n. We just multiply the powers, and that is 3 to the power of x over 2 whole to the power of 2 minus 2 to the power of x over 2 all to the power of 2 equals 65. Next is, we are going to let x be equal to 3 to the power of x over 2. And then, let's just let y be equal to 2 to the power of x over 2. Therefore, this is x squared minus y squared equals 65. And there is a rule. a squared minus b squared is also equal to a plus b times a minus b. So for this, we can write it as x plus y times x minus y is equal to 65. And to continue, we have x plus y times x minus y is equal to 65. So for this, we can write it as x plus y times x minus y equals for 65, we can write it as 13 times 5. So for this, we can have two equations. So the first equation is x plus y is equal to 13. Second equation is x minus y is equal to 5. And we can just add the two equations. So x plus x, that is 2x, y plus negative y, or y minus y, that is cancelled, equals 13 plus 5, that is 18. And we are going to divide both sides by 2. So the 2 will be cancelled. So that is x is equal to 18 divided by 2, that is equal to 9. So this is the value of x that is equal to 9. And then next is using the second equation which is x minus y is equal to 5. We are going to substitute the value of x here. So that is 9 minus y is equal to 5. And then let's take 9 to the other side and that is negative y is equal to 5 minus 9. Negative y is equal to 5 minus 9, that is negative 4. And let's divide both by negative 1. So cancel the negative here. So that is negative 1 divided by negative 1. So it will be canceled. So we have y is equal to negative 4 divided by negative 1 is equal to positive 4. So we have the value for y which is equal to 4. The next is, 
recall that x is equal to 3 to the power of x over 2. And y is equal to 2 to the power of x over 2. Now we are going to use either of the two. So that is 3 to the power of x over 2 is just equal to 9, which is the value of x. And then here, 3 to the power of x over 2. 9, we are going to write it in terms of 3. So that is 3 squared. Now that they have the same base, we can equate x over 2 is equal to 2. And then we can cross multiply 2 times 2, that is 4. x is equal to 4. So this is the value of x, which is equal to 4. That's all for today. Thank you for watching and subscribe to Fun with Maths.